I am here with first-time nominee up for her supporting role in The White Lotus. It's Alexandra Daddario. <sighs> So happy for you. Thank you. Your first time being at the Emmys as a nominee. People might not know, we did a movie together a few years ago. I'm so proud of you. How does it feel being here for the first time as a nominee? Oh, it's amazing. It's incredibly surreal, and also I feel really accomplished, and I'm really proud of um, all my castmates, and, and I'm just I'm just excited to be here. I feel like I like got invited to the cool kids party. You've always been a cool kid. Now tell us the story behind this incredible look that you're rocking. So this is Dior Haute Couture. I put it on and I didn't need to try anything else on. I just knew immediately it's hand beaded and gorgeous and I just feel, I feel gorgeous in it. And you look gorgeous. Now I'm obsessed with White Lotus. I've watched the whole thing three times and your character has this beautiful arc um, from not really fully believing in herself to finding her voice and finding her power. What would you say to folks out there who may be struggling in a relationship that doesn't serve them? What would you say to them about finding their voice and their power? Oh my gosh, my advice is to really go with your instinct. It's so hard and I've done this before where I've been trapped in the wrong situation and that certainly has happened to Rachel and while she doesn't leave him I think she will eventually and I encourage everyone to to get out of a bad situation if it's not right for you follow your instincts yeah our guts are telling us our bodies are telling us you look so stunning tonight I'm so happy for you proud of you have the best time tonight thank you so much mm, I'm so